Michael Scott was an Irish architect whose buildings included the Bussars Building in Dublin, Cork Opera House, the Abbey Theatre and both Tullamore and Portlaoise hospitals. He was born in Droida in 1905. His family originated in the province of Munster. His father, William Scott, was a school inspector from near Sneem on the Iver Peninsula in County Kerry. His mother was from County Cork. Michael was educated at Belvedere College, Dublin. There he first demonstrated his skills at painting and acting. Initially, he wanted to pursue a career as a painter but his father pointed out that it might make more financial sense to become an architect. Bussara Scott became an apprentice for the sum of £375 per annum to the Dublin architectural firm Jones & Kelly. He remained there from 1923 until 1926, where he studied under Alfred E. Jones. In the evenings after work, he also attended the Metropolitan School of Art and the Abbey School of Acting, and appeared in many plays there until 1927. Including the first productions of Sean O'Casey's Juno and the Paycock and the Plough and the Stars. On completing his pupillage he became an assistant to Charles James Dunlop and then had a brief spell as an assistant architect in the Office of Public Works. In 1931 he partnered with Norman D. Good to form Scott & Good, and they opened an office in Dublin. Scott & Goods designed the hospital at Tullamore and Portlaoise General Hospital. Between 1937 and 1938, Scott was the president of the Architectural Association of Ireland. He founded his company, Michael Scott Architects, in 1938. That same year he also designed his house Jera, at Sandy Cove, County Dublin. Scott's most important pre-war commission was the Irish Pavilion for the New York World Fair in 1938. Scott produced a shamrock-shaped building constructed in steel, concrete, and glass. It was selected by an international jury as the best building in the show. As a result, Scott was presented with a silver medal for distinguished services and given honorary citizenship of the City of New York by the then Mayor Fiorella La Guardia. Other better-known architects who designed national pavilions for this World Fair included Alvar Aalto of Finland and Oscar Niemeyer of Brazil. Scott had three major commissions from the Corps' Iampere Air and Sea, the Inchicore Chassis Works, the Donnybrook Bus Garage and, most famously, the Dublin Central Bus Station, to be known as a Ross Vic di Armada or Bussaras. Though initially controversial, Bussaras was to win Scott the Royal Institute of Architects of Ireland Triennial Gold Medal for Architecture. Scott was the founder of ROSC and the chairman of the board for many years. ROSC 67 was a large, first of its kind, Irish art exhibition which showed historic treasures from Irish history alongside hundreds of contemporary artworks. The Rusk series of exhibitions continued for 21 years. Later, Ronnie Tallon and Robin Walker became partners, and the firm was renamed Scott Tallon Walker in 1975, shortly after the firm won the Reba Royal Gold Medal. Scott, who spent most of his life living at Sandy Cove Point, just south of Dunleary in South Dublin, was buried near Sneem in County Kerry. Thanks for watching.